high school teams just battled it out to see who's best at fixing a car. At stake, a scholarship and a chance to compete in the nation's capital. Paul Brand joins us once again at Hennepin uh, Technical College with the winners. Hey. I think there was a Chad issue here with a recount because we've just finally got the winners here. First of all, let me introduce you to Alan Stanley from AAA in Orlando. Aren't you glad you came to Minnesota? It's a little colder than Florida. You bet. <laughs> Sponsors of the national program and Jeff Gurrell from the Ford Motor Company. Hi, Paul. How are you? Just find the regional manager. Now, Jeff, you do, we do know who's won now. We do finally know. Okay. We had a count, a recount, and then another count. Okay. And it is official that for the 11th consecutive year, Team... Fairbow High School has won it again, led by their illustrious coach, Mark. Uh, congratulations, gentlemen. Thank you so much. You bet. I'm going to come back to them in just a second. Okay. But first of all, the runner-up team, I get Ian uh, Rabanis from the guys at Rosemont High School, Ben Seeger and Ron Kelly. I, uh, Ian, when are you going to win this thing? Well, you know what? I'm wearing this uh, this uh, second second place uh, <laughs> hat once again. But uh, next year, next year we might be able to do it. I got You're, a couple of good kids then, too. You bet. Your guys did really well. Now, real quick, Mark Lessman, 11 years in a row, you won the national championship two or three years ago back to Washington this this June. Absolutely. We, uh, we are thrilled to actually be here. Uh, it gives an opportunity for these kids to compete, actually work on brand new vehicles, and actually win scholarship money. And yeah. real quickly, Ryan Preckle and Ryan Pankritz, you guys look like brothers. No, no, no. <laughs> well, good luck in Washington, guys. I'll tell you, a little bit cold here today, and it made it a little bit difficult, but I'll tell you what, these kids are very talented. They'll do well in Washington, and someday they're going to be fixing your car, Angela. That's great. They, they know what they're doing. That's fine. Good. Thank you, Paul. Well, we will have a recap of today's top stories when we come back. First of all, we'll give you another live look outside from our